God, he's posting about John Oliver again. I know, I know. One more time, there's a reason. It's been exactly six months since John Oliver threw down the gauntlet and took on the entire city of Danbury, resulting in the renaming of the John Oliver Memorial Sewer Plant. And given that passage of time, I just wanted to provide a little update for those who may have been following it to see how things have changed over those six months. I literally like just got an email today that had some great news that I immediately wanted to share, hence the, the low production value, lower than usual anyway. We at the Danbury Hattricks have been selling Dick Pants Danbury Fan Club t-shirts, obviously immortalizing John's most impactful cinematic performance with the mutual love between man and Hat City. We've been setting aside a portion of the proceeds for the ALS Association Connecticut chapter. And we're closing in on 800 shirts sold, 776 to be exact. The Danbury Hattricks today, to sort of cap things off, cut a check for the ALS Association Connecticut of just under $2,500. It's hard to put into words just how much this means to me on a personal level, but I just wanted to take a moment to thank everyone that was involved, uh, especially Bill and Jim Diamond, uh, who are at the top of the Danbury Arena and Danbury Hattricks organization. Uh, they donated $2,000 of their own money on top of that. So between that donation and the money that we've raised from the shirts, we've just about matched what John's $5,000 donation was. And then you factor in the individual donations that the ALS Association has received from you guys, the fans, and we've exceed, exceeded that mark. And that's, uh, wow, that is unbelievable. The whole reason we've been championing the ALS Association of Connecticut is because uh, ALS runs in my family. I come from a C9 family. My uncle passed from it a few years ago. My aunt is currently in the fight, uh, and I talk to them a lot. Uh, hey, Ron. Hey, Sandy. Love you guys. Uh, and they're blown away by by the support, and I know that they wanted to pass along their sincere thanks for everyone as well. Yeah, we, we post about it a lot. We run the joke into the ground, but the, the whole reason why we keep it going is because we keep getting positive messages like this one and and we've gotten emails and and tweets and comments from people who still are just discovering it and are making donations to their local chapters and i couldn't be more grateful the fight against als is brutal and to find a cure has been a real uphill battle i mean think about how long it's been since lou gehrig died uh 1940? I just looked it up. 1941. Okay. But my point is that we're only just now seeing scientific progress, and that comes from funding. So I implore all of you, if you're able, to look up your local ALS Association chapter. Uh, if you want, head to alsact.org and tell them the Danbury Hattrick sent you when you donate. Uh, every little bit matters because, you know, they'd normally be doing, you know, big walks and, and group fundraisers and well, we're still in a pandemic six months later, so it's still very hard for them to fundraise, so every little bit helps. To commemorate the six-month anniversary of this whole thing, and as a special thank you to you all, uh, we went ahead and made these. The Dick Pants Danbury Fan Club Special Edition Orange Hoodies. We're going to be giving these away to a couple of our fans, so subscribe to our channel and comment below if you want one. They're available in size large and XL. Sorry, there are no other sizes. Like, we literally only made a handful of them to give away, like, and I got one, so that's one off the pile. Uh, so if you want one, subscribe, comment below. We'll pick a couple winners in a few days. So thank you guys very much for subscribing. Thank you very much for following us, for joining in this fun little exchange that we've had. Thank you very much to Last Week Tonight for helping it reach the stage that it has. And I uh, hope everyone is keeping safe and healthy. Take care, everyone.